hi guys uh, it's me RC welcome to my channel this time I'm going to show you how to transfer file from a Mac OS to external hard drive I recently um, I got a WD hard drive with one terabyte uh, but uh, um, I was struggling to transfer file from um, my local to the external hard drive so hopefully this gonna help um, you guys as well um, so I'm gonna quickly show you um, how to do that um, so this is my device here um, and then uh, here is the file I like to transfer uh, to external hard drive um, uh, by default these are the file, uh, file system that comes with the um, WD hard drive um, uh, you don't need to worry about that so let me show you quickly this is my picture I'm on, I would like to transfer this one to external hard drive um, so let me um, do this I just drag and drop but for some reason I can't able to um, drop here so when I um, go and check get info um, uh, here at the very bottom uh, sharing and permissions I only have read permission um, what I found out about this one is by default um, all the w, WD external hard drive has anti file um, anti FS file system that means they are compatible for Windows machines where we should be able to read and write in Windows without doing anything but for Mac OS um, because Mac OS um, doesn't support anti file anti FS file system by default so you have to like change the file system um, and um, I don't know why they do that but I think it's more because of the user number of user um, is still using quite large number of users is still using um, Windows rather than Mac OS so I think that was the reason I believe um, but let's let's focus on the solution here so um, we go to Dix uh, utility um, uh, from the normal search and then you can see internal um, file system and this is external where this is my um, hard drive um, so here we can click on erase and change to extra uh, extended fat because this means we should be able to use uh, in windows as well as mac os but if we select one of these here this is just um, ios centric so we we may have problem when we are using in windows if we select one of these uh, so i'm going to select this one here and leave as it is and erase so i got this error here um it says media kid report um uh, it, not enough space so um i guess um, normally you shouldn't um, see this issue but if you see this issue i think there is a way to get around it so let me just uh, done this one and then what we what i'm going to do is right click eject so once i eject uh, it should be gray label and i'm going to create uh, arrays again uh, and extended fat um so erase that hopefully yeah so i got this option now um whether you want to use uh, backup this or don't use so this time i'm just gonna say don't use and um the operation is completed now so that's the way we should be able to mount um so let me try to um open the file here um so now my dix is like uh, empty and then if i just drag and drop yeah there you go um now i'm able to copy and paste the uh, files um like this uh that's 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 all for this time <laughs> Oh, no, go